Right, okay. Uh, well, I just want to do a quick tip video. This is something about, you know, some of the big knives I've got. And you see, I've got a lot of big knives and a lot of people out there got big knives. But one thing that I like to uh, see in a big knife, if you're out and about like this here in the wilderness, is to make sure you've got an easy edge to sharpen. You. Right, so you can see from here to here is essentially a straight edge. There's no curvature in that edge there. And that means when you put that on a stone to sharpen that, that's going to make that really easy to uh, sharpen. You've only got a little bit of a curve up there like that. Let's put that away and I'll show you another one now too, which is an easy knife to sharpen. That's got a flat uh, bevel on it there. This one now has a convex edge and this is pretty much straight from here to here. Can you see that there? Right, and then you've just got this curve to deal with up there. So that's a convex edge, and you've seen me just recently sharpening this. These are both big knives. Um, yeah, they both have their virtues uh, out in the wilderness like this. Okay, so look for an edge which is pretty simple. Now, you know I've got some knives too, like my FKMD Paris, and it's got a recurve on it. It's got a very funky blade. It's a very useful blade too, but it's a little bit more difficult to sharpen. So if you're a beginner or looking to get in a big knife for going out in the wilds to begin with, uh, I would stick with a straight edge, the maximum straight edge possible because it makes it really easy to sharpen. When you're out here, you can't be taking out, you know, big sharpening stones with you. In, in fact, I'll just, I'll just show you what I've got here. Uh, okay, so um, I've just got a small bit of sharpening stone with me, which I know will suit both of these steels, N690 and OS8, both of them have got a pretty high Rockwell on it. This is probably getting close to 60 on this, and this one's 58, you know, on here, but this is just a small bit of sharpening stone, and that's all you need, really. You can't be carrying out huge stones with you if you're, you know, packing in. Uh, it's different if you're with a vehicle. Anyway, that's my tip for the week. Thanks for watching Bush Camping Tour.